What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. We are going to play a standard, a standard deck here, on uh, on MTG Arena. So back again to the arena. Welcome to the arena. And um, this is going to be a Naya Angels list. And in the deck, we have four land elves, four growth chamber guardians, three crawl harpooners, which are pretty sick in this in this uh, in this meta game, I believe. Two lava coil, four spellbreaker, four knight of autumn, both of which are solid three drops in their in their clan in their guilds. One Fight with Fire, which I like. Uh, three Rhythm, which I'm a huge fan of. One Collision Colossus, which is great because you get to uh, kill a flyer. Or you can just give your dude give your dude big out of, out of nowhere. Uh, you have two Shalais and two Aurelias. So those are two legendary angels that we have. We also have two Angel of Grace, two Lyra Dawnberger, and two Skargan Hellkites. Um, one issue I've taken immediately with the deck is we have four Land of War Elves, but we only have four Stomping Ground, four Temple Garden and one forest. So we only have nine sources of green mana that come into play untapped on turn one in order to enable a turn one elf. I guess a turn two elf is fine, but it only ramps us to four, not three. But, I mean, what are you gonna do? It's standard. You're not gonna have as many green sources. You don't have fetch lands. Um, we have four Cinder Vines, three Deft and Clarion, two Settle, two Vivian, one Tristani, and two Carnage Tyrant in the sideboard. And we're just gonna play some ranked constructed games. And see how this bad boy goes with sideboards because we are not savages. Uh, I will play first because again, we're not savages. Is this hand keepable? I believe it's keepable. We need one more land, but we have all of our colors, so I'm okay with that. Our opponent went to six, so we're clearly going to win. Enter tap. All right. I also like Rhythm of the Wild. I'm a big Rhythm of the Wild fan. It feels very strong every time I play it. Mm. Okay. Well, this is nice because now we have turn three rhythm into turn four. Either one of these is great. Or Shalai on turn four is pretty nice. Oh, that's just rude. Are they playing like the the tempo deck? Is this just the tempo deck again? Okay. Well. Just like a control deck? Sure. Wow. So I wish we had one more land, but. If we had one more land, we can play Gross Chamber Guardian and fight with and uh fight with fire. I really don't want to let this survive though, because I mean, if they untap, they could have any number of things like spell, spell pierce, or dive down, or... Whatever. Pay two life, and then I'm just gonna pass and keep up Angel of Grace. Oh, I guess we should have waited. I mean, I wanted to play this in response because they wouldn't have a counter, but I guess we gave them a target for that. We should have let this resolve, have them put the trigger on the stack, and then play this. Yep, this is exactly why. That's really frustrating. Well, what can you do? I guess play correctly in the future. That's what you can do. You just happen to have another wizard's retort? Destroy an artifact or an enchantment. Um, 
Yeah, I feel like that's just the the correct play. And you have what? Uh, one, two, three spells. So this guy's going to cost five. If we hit one more land, we can play Shalai and pump this guy. <laughs> Show me you can manage this interface. Wow. Sure. Easy block. Sure. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. So what? They don't have six when they have one, two, three, four. So they're two away. I don't think he can attack with that guy, though. Do not think so. So if we attack with everything... Actually, I can probably just attack with Angel. I mean, if you want to trade here, that's totally fine. So we can actually pump these guys up. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, Deafening Clay Around seems pretty good here. Probably better than... I mean, Crawl Harpooner seems great. Lava Coil seems great. Fight with Fire seems like it probably could just be... I mean, I'd rather draw a Deafening Clay Around than a Fight with Fire, I would assume. The problem with Clay Around is that it does kill most of our creatures. Also, Sell the Wreckage seems very good. Vivian Reed also seems good. Man. This deck almost seems like tweaked to beat the <laughs> to beat this deck. Chew Poshi, what's going on, you old you old chestnut you? The nice thing is outside of like uh, Wizards Retort, if they don't have, oh that's pretty good, if they don't have uh, Spell Pierce, then they, or if they don't have Wizards Retort, they can't really, it's, it's really hard to do. Wow, that's pretty comical. Essence Capture on a land or out. And then you net no cards there, so that's good. Yep, they never don't have that. Do 
you just try to settle? Like, it seems like it's terrible, right? I mean, they could have Spell Pierce or Capture. I mean, I'd rather just play... Like, next turn we can play both of these or this. So I'm not like, too concerned with it. No Pierce, no Retort. This is Tameful Stroke, too. Fascinating. Yep. We're in a bunch of cards against this guy, but... One, two, three, four. So it's going to cost four to pump that dude. Sounds good. Six, seven, eight. One, two, three, one, two. Yeah, we're just not going to be able to do this. Yep, that's game. Like, it's almost like settles too slow because I want cheaper things, which I mean is true. Five seems good. Well, we're definitely winning against the deck on five, that's for sure. Yeah, of course, they kept seven. Why wouldn't they? Um, yeah, I'll actually keep that. Of course, it's on the five. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I got Crawl Harpooner and Collision Colossus in hand. Oh yeah, play a flyer. Nope. Couldn't have been a Styron Storm Tamer or a Terramander. Had to be the the 33% chance that it was not one of those, I guess. And they have two of them. I will pass if you want to trade both of these. Wow, that's insane. I for sure thought they were going to uh, to dive down the one in front so that they both survive. And then we could have Collision Colossus, but... Surprisingly well on board. If we hit land, land, we're in really good shape. Two cards to five cards, but guy on board, so essentially two cards to four cards. Oh, it's little Terry. Don't have essence capture. They never don't have it. Never don't have it. I'm 
waiting. It's not hard. Yeah. Lucky, 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 lucky. I have no idea why you would wait that long. Wait. Oh, you didn't put a count. Oh, they're deciding whether to make their guy a 2 2 or whether to make sure you can evolve it one day. No, oh, 4 2. 4 3. Lands are good and spells are good. You got it. That feels good. Oh, look, no attacks by anybody. Well. That guy, I, I have no... I have nothing over the back here. Three, four, five, six, seven, sure. One, two, so it costs six, so they're not even close to pumping this guy. I faced Tireless Tracker on Arena earlier today. It felt weird, but I can imagine. It's like your doppelganger. Alright, well, we're just drawing mono lands here, so that's pretty cool. And if they couldn't do it last turn, they can't do it this turn, I imagine. So, just gonna throw them in. I would like a non land card. Okay. Um. Double dive down actually comically kills the Lyra, but if they have a single dive down on like one of these guys, we can still kill two of them. Okay. Yeah, we're still killing two, and they get to deal three back, which is totally fine. Because now we have Lyra, and they have nothing else. So. And they're at three, and we're at 18. I don't know, feels pretty okay. Oh, this seems desperate. <laughs> this this seems bad. I think we're going to uh, the next round, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so you're dead. Why would you do that? I mean, we drew three lands off the top, so... Deck is still sweet. Still is in right now for the first time. To keep on the trouble block was weird. I figured if they have double dive down, they can just make their first guy a one seven, and then the rest of the guys would clean up so they would actually be able to kill our guy. But one dive down just means I get to kill two of their guys, nothing happens, gain five. The double block on Harpooner was also weird. Again, I was like, well, if you have one dive down, you get to trade. Dive down for Crawl Harpooner. 
but you did not. If we can draw three lands here, I'd be in great shape. I'm still gonna probably play this on turn two. I, it's better than growth chamber. It guarantees us a land, a mana, a mana, not a land. Gives us that mana we need. Jokes on you, I got another one in hand. What I don't have is a third mana, third land. One of my pet peeves is using the word mana and land interchangeably when they're not the same. Well, that's frustrating. biggest fear is them always having multiple nickel bolluses. My biggest fear is that someone will put a cucumber behind me while I'm eating. <laughs> what are you, a cat? Oh, man. All right, now we're getting somewhere. keeping this guy because we don't have eight mana to double shoot Nicobolus yet, so I'd rather just have an answer for like a Nicobolus before they go a flipping. They have four cards. What could they be? What can they be? Knocking on my door. Oh, now we can crawl Harpooner and uh, shoot the chicken. Uh, submit. Submit. Or we can just do that, I guess. Look at that beautiful chicken. The one with the waggly tail. So they're just dead, right? Okay, just checking. Just checking. I'm just checking. Oh, Carnage Tyrant? That's a good one. Fight with fire? You're alright. Actually, I mean, you don't deal with chicken very well. Crawl Harpooner was, again, very good. Collision Colossus. I mean, they have Nicobolus and... Rekindling Phoenix. <sighs> kind of definitely want those guys, but they do have... They do have the, the Eldest Reborn. I also like Vivian Reed here.
Everything in our deck seems very good. Again with the rootbound crag and the Llanowar elves. I mean, we'll keep it. I'm not gonna love it, but I mean, we could actually draw a green source. We did not. Well, that's obnoxious. When I come to Chicago, Kuma's Heavy Metal Burger Bar? That sounds awesome. I'm in. say no here. That's nice. The improbable burger made with real uncertainty. That's also my favorite. I think you just take the Llanowar Elves out. This does not feel like a Llanowar Elf deck. Harpooner, my dude. <laughs> Wish we were at nine instead.
All right, I'm gonna buy ourselves some turns here. Okay, how many lands are in this deck? I don't know. There is a lot. So 24? That's a good amount. Like that's a reasonable amount is what I'm saying. Um There are 100 lands in this deck. Well, I feel, I feel like over the course of this of the two matches I've played, that's that's correct. for oh they're sideboarding I was like what's the hold up here What's the hold up? They are panicking. Uh oh, snappers. Snapperusk. Wow. Seriously, I have one Vivian Reed that you can take? That's stupid. You're stupid. God, the value's so high there. Oh, nice. Okay, so now I feel better about it. What's that? You're tapped out? Deal. Give me my boy. Crab boy gonna, crab boy gonna give it to you. I'm some zip it to you. I'm about to zip it to you. A crab can give it to you. Sure. You can take whatever you want. My hand is stacked. They took that because they have ritual of soot, and they don't care about all of our two drops. But now you got to care about this, my dude. I'm gonna haste this guy up. If you're in a ritual of soot, I don't want to stick around for a turn. That's fine. You can just ritual this turn. Oh, you're just dead. All right. Well, we're we're good. I don't like these land of war elves in this deck. I think they just hold the whole thing, the whole thing back. I'm not gonna change it yet because maybe they know something I don't. But X gonna give it to you. drop four drop five drop I mean, this is fine ideally we'll top deck a lana elf that we hate so much nope that wasn't it a 
What another fascinating specimen. How many how many crab boys are you gonna put in the yard? How many how many birdie boys are you gonna put in that yard? None? Okay. This doesn't matter if it's a three or a four in this matchup, really. Um I can't imagine like they could have lightning strikes, I guess, but I'm pretty sure they're just going to have lava coil if they're going to kill this thing with something. But either way, I'm going to make it a 4 forward because they could have lightning strikes. Um, Aurelia. Target creature control. That creature gets plus two, plus two. It gains trample of its red, so it's. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, so your overlay something happened to your hybrid battery. Oh, uh, yeah, I actually had to get my hybrid battery replaced. It cost me like 700 bones, and the combination meter cost me about 300 to repair. In total, it was all like 1,200 bones. So. It was pretty rough, but the Prius should have a. a, a, a longer lifespan now. What happened? Shock and lava coil. The old two for one. Hey, that's pretty good. Unfortunate, but all oh, right. Congrats, you just made a crawl worm. Not impressed. <laughs> oh, that's that's rude. You're being rude. Oh, they took two from that guy. Huh? Okay. Dive down one of them, my dude. Dive them down. One, two, three, four, five, six. So close. I'll take action. Are we really just trading with both of these? We're in good shape here. How big is that guy? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So, yeah, okay. So this guy costs one to, one to evoke. card dive down. Okay. I feel like if it was, you should have played it first because that would have been cheaper. Okay. Nice. These are all really weird trades.
What is up, nerds? That's rude. That's rude to the felt. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I want to keep five, six. Yeah, we can do that. Play this guy. We'll keep Angel of Grace up. Every time, can I ask? Every time uh, a sacred foundry comes into play, does it sound like the World of Warcraft sound when you're crafting things? That's the only thing I think of. The World of Warcraft, uh, the crafting, the World of Warcraft crafting sound. The World of Warcrafting sound. Vivian Reed seems utterly OP in this deck. But that's pretty much the only thing I care about. So I'm just gonna put these guys back in. Again, Crawl Harpooner kills, it's just literally a, a two mana. Why does it all sound like water splashing? You hear that? It's just the World of Warcraft sound, guys. Craggles into this guy. It sounds something of it sounds some something. It's what when I play ooze, it sounds some something a farting slimer. That's I feel like the I feel like you're missing a word there. Yeah, we didn't see. Um, sorry, I, <laughs> I had a stroke. <laughs> Oh god, please be joking. I hope you're not like, no, you seriously had a stroke and it caused me to type terribly. Because then that, then I would feel bad that I laughed at that, but I, I'm assuming it's a joke. As a joke, I, I gave you a laugh. I gave you a chuckle because that was funny. <laughs> oh, a bondulence. Okay, well. Yep, yeah, we're doing good here. Um... Growth Chamber Guardian definitely sounds... It's even worse when you play, when you activate the ability and they leave it on the stack for like 20 minutes and you're just like, oh god, it's just like one long... It's just one long fart. Okay, so we're gonna play this. And we're gonna play this. And then we're gonna coil this. And then we're good. Oh, we could have crawl harpooned it as well. No, we couldn't have. Crawl harpoon, I would have died. You got y'all got any more of that Lyra haste?
Where did my Lyra go? Oh, they bolted it. Yeah, so even a 6-6 wouldn't have survived that. Um... Yeah. Oh, we can actually put a counter on this guy? I don't think that does anything though, right? So it makes it a 4-4. Yeah, there's no way it survives. Take that action. I'll have a piece of that action. Hey, three more lands and we can play, uh, we can, we can kick this. Oh, well, they didn't like that. Nope, don't like that. Oh, I do like that. Uh, let's go haste it. Yeah, we'll put the counters on there. And then we'll just get them. I mean, they're going to kill it with this anyway. It doesn't matter, so we might as well get the damage in. They got a bacon bolt in their hand. But, like, giving all our guys haste means that, like, we get, like, one hit with all of our creatures at least. So that's pretty sick. I'm kind of wishing we just made this a 4-3 and attacked with a turn to come into play. Because they'd be at 2, and then we'd still have fight with fire to get rid of the drake. Oh yes, let's do that. That's a yikes for me. Any any creature we have is basically just lethal. What? Hmm. Hmm. Uh, one encounter. So one, two, three, four, five. Haste. And two counters. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, we're just gonna. That's fine. I'm just gonna pass here. We can fight with fire this, but if they play like a crackling Drake, well, they're actually second blue, which is probably gonna be their their doom, I guess. Our wilds are sufficiently rhythmic right now. This is the rhythm of the wild. Whoa. Oh yeah. The rhythm of the wild. Yeah, it can't be counted. One, one, please. Yeah, this seems good. All right, so we're 3-0. I mean, that's presumptuous of me, I guess. We, we might not be 3-0, right? Did they steal that? What does that do? Nothing. Dummy. Got him. Did you see us got him? I was there. Now go buy yourself a spaceship. Let's get a couple more games in. Guys, how many cube drafts should I do tomorrow? Can I get a can I get a some chat opinions on how many cube drafts we can do tomorrow? Me and you and Michael B2. Uh, oh, look, we get to play an Atlanta War Elf into a... Yeah, see, this is the one of the few times where I'm like, all right, I'm, I'm game. I am all about turn one elf into turn two dewey, dewey doos. Mike went to go eat dinner with his parents, but I don't think he's even left yet. He has not left yet. Uh, let's play this guy, so if we draw any untapped land. Huh. 
That's rude. You're rude. Man, people love these blue-red decks. Wait, aren't supposed to go with him as his father? No, he he goes he goes with his other family. Whatever that means. I would have liked to land there, but you know. Oh, two of these little little gentlemen, huh? Okay. I feel like this is a fine trade. Oh, they're not going to trade at all. That's fascinating. So I just messaged Mike at 7.44. He hasn't seen it or responded. My, I 100% bet he fell asleep, which is unbelievable to me. Because it is 7.45 at night. Uh, we went out to the couch in between the rounds, like right, right after the last, the last uh, video ended. And he was like sitting there with his eyes closed like this. And I was like, are you falling asleep on the couch? He's like, no, I'm just resting my eyes. I was just closing my eyes. I'm like, that's literally sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> just like, okay, man. It's not a power nap, dude. It's... Don't, like, don't... I'm getting... It's, it's, it's getting really exhausting, like, people saying be nice to me. Like, I'm... Probably, I'm the most supportive person Mike has in his life, I guarantee you. I love Mike to death. I just worry about him, that's all. Um, three, four, five, six, seven. You have two mana, you have nothing in the graveyard. I'll take five and assume you can't kill me here. Pinch off that mana. Yeah, that's fine. Three, four, five, six, seven. We can gain four here, actually. That seems decently safe. Got him. Well, that would be cool if we had the mana for it. So, three, two, we can attack a Spellbreaker too. And they have to block at least two creatures. So they lose both of these guys. So if they block here, block here, they take five and die. So they actually have to block big creatures. They can't, they don't have the luxury to block land or elves here, which is pretty great. Don't say pinch off. Who said pinch off? Did I say pinch off? Are we talking about poops again? Poop stream? Alright, well, this deck again, so... 
I guess it's just vivs. Except this one has phoenixes, it looks like, which also is more annoying. And they also have Electromancer. Don't be so hard on yourself. It's not a poop stream. Wait. I, aren't all poop all aren't all streams poop streams though? Hmm. I mean, Cinder Vines could be good. Yeah. Take out, I'm going to take out all these dudes. I don't care about the Land of War Elves, guys. I'm sorry. Take out Fight with Fire. Do you just play in four Cinder Vines and just really penalize them? I don't know. I didn't play Cinder Vines against the last Drake deck just because I feel like it's almost too slow. And it doesn't. there's no enchantments or artifacts it kills, so you're just really relying on the deal one damage portion. Yeah, whatever. This hand is super slow, but whatever. Let's go Temple Gardenia. Poop stream, but not in terms of quality, just in terms of how much we talk about poop. Yeah, okay. I can get behind it. Never didn't shat it. <laughs> I'm not a big fan of Never Didn't Shat It, just because, no. We boarded in four Cinder Vines. They just drew a thousand cards. What's a what's a crawl harpooner doing in a place like this? Let's give him a counter. And it survives? Holy bones. Oh boy, that guy survives. That was the best crawl harpooner I'd ever seen in my life. Wow. I was not expecting it to survive. I was just expecting to get the perk of the counter so that I wouldn't have to, uh, that I wouldn't have to have anything in my graveyard. I was like, oh, cool. I don't have a creature in my graveyard, but that's fine because it gets a plus one, plus one counter. So everybody wins, but it turns out only we win. Eating a sandwich. Thanks so much for the bits. Really appreciate it, buddy. Wish I had a land here because then I could play one of these four or five drops. Uh, one of which takes down this, but I guess. How about eight, yeah? Okay, seems good. This is the rhythm of the wild. Whoa. Oh, yeah. Three, four, five, six, seven. I'll go to six. Okay, I was like, you can't attack with all three because if I have any hasty creature, you're just dead. Or not. So now I don't know why you didn't attack with this guy because I don't think I can deal you an extra eight points here. Um. So I can just play a Lyra here and I don't know how you beat that, but...
So where are we at? We're at six. We go to eleven. One, two, three, four, six, seven. You have eight on board, and we got yeah. We're just gonna this up. Okay, so we took three power off the board and we gained six. Five. Seems seems pretty good. If they have entrancing melee, it's rough, but. And we could Vivian Reed kill our own liar, I guess. Tormenting voice is not an entrancing melee. Boy, Cinnervines would really be penalizing them for this. Shock Lyra. Sure. Shit and fire, Lyra. Sounds good. Get your stupid bird back. Block. Oh, actually, we should have just... I thought we were going to attack. I thought we were going to attack, so I was thinking of hasting it, but then I realized they were at 12, so... I'm just going to keep this guy back so we don't take... Go to three here. I don't feel like that's safe. One, two, three... We have six mana, so... Oh, nice. Seems good. Must be... I don't know. What's... I got... Always having an answer seems pretty sweet. That's a hell of a way to live. July and rhythm no. Um Yeah, we're just gonna pass here and play Angel of Grace and assume they don't have a counter spell. Uh okay, for sure. Um, what do they have? A beacon bolt for seven? Yes, yeah, so this is dead anyway. So I might as well kill this. I guess we could have made them use the beacon bolt, but... Now I go back up to six. The murmuring. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We almost have to use this. Let me take three, four, five, six, seven. We go to three. Yeah, I think this game's over. Crawl Harpooner is seeming better now. I mean, I feel like we have infinites. If we have a bunch of cinder vines, they just probably can't win the game, right? I don't like Carnage Snarch just because it gets blocked by um, all of the all of the drakes. So does everything else, but everything else costs five. I feel like if we can just go cinder vines, cinder vines, I mean, if we can just open on two cinder vines, I don't know if they can even win. Like, this is really hard for them to deal with. But, we have to draw one out of the four that we put in here, so. We did it. We don't have a green source, though. I'm gonna keep this hand in hopes that we hit green source, I guess. Ugh. God, cringy. Green source one time. I mean, it's easy to draw cinder vines, but you just can't get a green source. You're like, well, sorry, buddy. Yeah, that's amazing. Actually incredible. Are they missing a land drop? Or is this our turn? What are they like? Why is it taking so long? 
stupid opt. Amazing. Actually incredible. I just don't even have words for this. Here's two green cards. Thank you. I appreciate it. How did you lose? Well, we lost one round. And uh, it turned out we weren't able to play any of the spells in our hand. So... Um, we basically watched our opponent play against us, and that was how we lost. <gasps> oh, wow. Wow, that's awkward. Well, I guess they can't counter this. Yeah, I still think it's Cindervine, too. If we play this, they're just super easy to kill, even with a shock. And I don't want to play this until we can actually adapt it. Crawl Harper doesn't do anything, this doesn't do anything. So it's either it's between Spellbreaker, Spellbreaker and Cinder Vines, and Spellbreaker also doesn't do a ton here. The S is for Solitaire. Yep. Get out of here, you big idiot. Oh, that'd be great if we had a... I mean, on the bright side, if they want to bring back their, uh, their, their Arclight Phoenix, they have to take three. Sure. Gate. Let's tear this place up. No one knows the wilds like I do. I don't think we want the land here. I think we just want like Shalai. Yeah, that seems good. No attacks. Got him. So if we hit a land, we can play Crawl Harpooner and Shalai, which is pretty nice. And if you guys are looking to rent cards, uh, physical paper cards, or even digital cards on Magic Online, definitely head on over to manatraders.com and you can find the link and the promo code in my description. You get 20% off the first three months of any subscription, which is a pretty sweet deal. You can also check out meundies.com slash frankrecore and you'll get 15% off along with free shipping and free returns. Both of those are sweet deals. They're gonna take like a million from this center vines, but they got a little bird army over here. And now we're taking one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven. So we're taking one. Not dead yet. No, you are actually dead. Why would you say not dead yet when you actually are dead? That's weird. So what can we kill? Kill a phoenix, or you can just play Shalai, kill a bird. Yeah, it's unlikely we're going to draw Clarion. We don't have any Deafening Clarions in the deck. Oh, yeah, that's 
pretty good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Three one, I think. Let's open this one pack. Let's get my gems. Oh, it's a it's a rare. Let's also also guys. Let's also. Play one more. We can do it. Live the dream. Oh, this deck again. Well, at least we have Crawl Harpooner, but they're going to put the stupid thing on here, so I guess that's... They always do. They didn't this time. I'm impressed. Did we just get a free kill? No, because they just have Dive Down. Come on, let's be real. Don't be silly, me. Oh. I hope they Dive Down preemptively. They didn't have dive down. I'm feeling very awkward now. Did they forget this guy has reach? Oh, gas. Gasoline. <laughs> the shame scoop to the reach. Oh, reach, I see. Well, I suppose I'll concede then. Yeah, sounds good. I I approve. Taking these elves out, putting in three clarions. And... None of these other cards are great. I guess just one Vivian Reed. You gotta play to your outs. Yeah, I guess that's true. Do you know what would pump your angels? Would it be Lyra? Would Lyra pump my angels? I'm gonna keep this. Would it be this card right here? Is that an angel pumper? <laughs> Somewhere, someone is tapping a mana in response to land destruction with no actual use for the mana. Seen it on a stream. That's true. Okay, you got it. Buddy, listen, let me tell you something about your stupid siren tamer. 
Buddy, I will shoot it in the face. I didn't target it. Because why would I target it? Ugh. I'm cringing so hard right now. I don't want to live on this planet anymore. so sad even if they had the dive down well I guess we are guy would have died that's so sad dude because usually here's the thing every single card on magic online that targets something if it only has one legal target which this did it was the only flyer it will target it automatically and then you just hit submit like that's literally how the client works But here we are. I hope they try to counter this. <laughs> yes! Oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. No, sir, buddy. No, sir. Oh, my God. This game has been gas. <laughs> and all was right with the world. <laughs> Fantastic. Okay. I accept. Okay, we got rid of this thing finally. Perfect. Just perfect. Tempest Gin, sure. Don't care. I think we're attacking. I would like another white source so I can play Lyra next turn. They just block, right? That seems bad. Pretty easy block here, but then they have to. Get out, so we have to really... We're at two, so we gotta really, uh. We gotta really buckle down here. I think we're dead. Oh, we actually. No, we don't have the mana for that. I think we're dead. This is how being dead works. So that's cool. We get to try a game three. Remember that time we had Deafening Clarion in the deck? Me too. So, relevant cards in this matchup, we have three Crawl Harpooners, three Deafening Clarions. Lots of other things. Oh, Spock. Oh, bleh. Well, we're not going to mess this up again, boys. Target this guy. Take the action. Kill it. Put it in your garbage can, my dude. We do need a white source to play this knight, but... 
Give me another one. Yeah, that's fine. It's actually fast enough. I'm just gonna six you. One legal target achieved, Buck. We did it. We did it. I hope they tap out for a Tempest Gin. They didn't tap out for anything. That's fascinating to me. Alright. Well, this guy's getting countered for sure, but whatever. No, wait. Yes. Yes, it is. Sure. I mean... Okay, bunch of... Have one card in hand, they're probably gonna sack this guy to, to counter it, which is fine. <coughs> Yeah, the blue deck is miserable. Wow, this is great. Yeah, this is good deals. They have one card, we have four cards. Yeah. We're doing well here. We just need to hit a fourth land or a white source, but it doesn't really matter because we're going to end up for one. All right. That was pretty sweet. So yeah, nine angels. Not too bad. Uh, I think the mana base could use some tweaking. I also think the uh, land or elves are not my favorite. I don't know if they're necessary or not, but maybe they are. Either way, thank you guys for watching. Really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out at manatraders.com, coolstuffinc.com with promo code 5, and uh, meundies.com slash franklapore. All of those things are great ways to help the stream, and you get things out of them as well. You get 20% off, 15% off, 5% off. Discounts abound. You can also slam those like and subscribe buttons, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.